Hey guys, it's me, Melissa, and welcome back to my channel. Today we got a haul from Wombway, which I've had for probably four to five months. I just got away from me. And I've actually been having more fun shopping on Shein now because I feel like I can get my points up better and they always do free shipping on Sunday so I can pick up a thing here and there. But I did have this order and I've had it forever. Some of these items I now don't know if I'm actually going to use because I've got other things that were going in my brain that I wanted to get done instead, like a little DIY situation. Also, you will also see me in this outfit in tomorrow's video. It'll be the Walmart Beauty Box, just because why go change? <laughs> Alright, without further ado, I use my points to try to get these things as cheap as possible and use the free shipping whenever I could. I don't, I'm pretty sure this was one order, but I'm not exactly sure. So this right here, my favorite thing in the whole entire world. This is regularly... Uh, $3.50, and I got it for $3. Love. <laughs> I would like to have a backup when one breaks. This is a retractable fly swatter. I know you might say, that's stupid, Melissa. <laughs> but, my back porch is screened in. We call it a screened in little eye. But, we have these, we have a lot of bugs in Florida. And one thing we do have, and you've heard me talk about before, are palmetto bugs. Now, palmetto bugs... They usually, I will usually never, never find them in the house. They're always just on the back porch. And they are just big roaches. Big. They live in the palmetto trees. And they're just, that's just, it's a thing. It's a thing in Florida. If you've seen them, they actually fly. It can be ridiculous. First time you ever see one, you might like be like, oh my God, that's ridiculous. But then you become accustomed to it. I've been living here a long time. But a lot of times, they're up high. <laughs> or far away. And then it's, shake them out. Now obviously, hitting something like this a bunch of times... The plastic does give out on you, but I don't care. I have this one, and I have one outside right now. This one actually is a little bit nicer, because it has that cushiony grab to save me when I'm taking them out. <laughs> I don't really kill, like, tons of bugs, but those palmetto bugs, they should have never been a thing. They should have never been a thing. <laughs> All right, next thing I bought was this, just because I had to have it. This was regularly $2, and with my points, I got it for $1.73. Oh, one looks like it's broken or it needs to just have something put on top. Let me get them all out. I'm, I have an awful black thumb. Is it slide back on? Yes. So it came with this one, this little shovel, and this shovel. And I was going to put them sticking into my plant outside. You know, let me do a stick them out there. Even though I probably need to water it and I'm awful. I'm just awful at plants. You can only use this if you want to give it to your kid to like do a little like gardening himself or whatever, but I wanted to use it as like, I don't know, like decoration. I kind of only wanted one two. You want to put two in there? So let's go do that. I'll show it to you and then we'll move on. I don't know. I think it's cute. That's not close. I do need to water this plant. Also, whoever gave me this, I actually grew it. Look, we got basil. Still using this thing to water it. But yeah, I thought it was a neat little thing. You could just, I don't know. I don't know. You know me. I buy weird stuff. But dad, the plant's still alive. <laughs> Alright, moving on. Alright guys, now moving on to the next thing. This was regularly $2 and I paid $1.73. I didn't buy this for home. I bought it for work. I have some at home. Like I have ones like this, but they're a little more hardcore. They got metal pieces here and there's a third piece so we take all three sides of your sheets on your bed keep it on lockdown because they always seem to be sliding off. I got this for work, which I hope is going to work. I might have to hook two together. So try to, I have a blanket on my bed at work because I'm an esthetician, so I have a bed. And then I have like a squishy thing on top of it, but then I wanted to put a, a blanket on top of that, but it's not, it's just kind of like flopping. So they give you how many? Three, four. So I'm thinking this won't go across obviously my whole entire thing, but maybe if I hook two together, which I know can be done. That'll go all the way across, so I can have two p places where it'll kind of cinch in, so they're not kind of like hanging out. I think it'll work just fine. Yeah, I'm gonna bring them to work tomorrow. <laughs> so that's that. This is always trying to be funny. Like, this was 75 cents and I got it for 66 cents. We were on a cruise once and I like to play my 
like, like I always have to have some sort of sound. On a cruise, there really isn't any sound going on. So I play a sound machine app on my phone all night long. Rob is not a big fan. <laughs> Rob is not a huge fan. So I bought him these <laughs> to give him on the cruise. <laughs> I don't know. You could probably get a pair of these cheaper somewhere else. He'll be thrilled that they're pink. <laughs> yes, he likes to sleep with like a TV on, which I can't do. I'm like, how do you do a TV, but you can't do a sound machine? So yeah, a little bit of earbuds, plugs. I'll just pack them in the next thing, and I'll, if he's like complaining about it, I'll be like, I brought you these. Now you're all set. <laughs> all right, now this one is the item that I'm planning on doing a DIY, hopefully. So I might not need this, and I might just end up putting it to the flea market. Because I love my other one, but I kind of wanted to change. So this was regularly $7, and I got it for $5.89. I don't know where it opens at. Some of these ones are just very difficult. Flip it open. And this is a really neat idea. I think they don't want you to get into anything. I think it would be wrapped somewhere. One second. I got it. So this right here opens up and you can put earrings all over it. And it's really handy, and it actually does a great job. And you can close it up so it doesn't take up a lot of room. But I find that I don't, like, look at them as much when they're like this. Like, I would rather have it, like, just showing to me at all times. So I'm going to try to DIY myself an earring holder. Plus, these tell you exactly where you can put them, where what I'm going to do is be able to kind of put wherever you want, wherever you want it. So I'm going to keep this, because I've ordered some more earrings from Romway. And I, you know, I just, I mean, I know I didn't change them today or the next video just because I just got home from the doctor's, just a regular routine appointment. Um, but I would like to see if I could do it. If I can't, then I got this. So I'm not going to do anything until I know. <laughs> for sure. Then I bought this thing. It was regularly $1.25. I got it for $1.08. I think my mom is one of these, but it's in metal. This is in plastic. It's for your comb or brush. So I don't know why. My brush has dust or something, fur, fuzz, I don't want it. I'm going to show it to you, but no judgment. But I'm hoping this solves it. Like, why does my brush have these? But I don't want to buy a new one. Like, my hair's not dusty. Like, what happens? And this is not really doing the job. I feel like my mom's one has closer together bristles like it's taking some stuff off are you grossed out by my brush <laughs> i've still been using it all the time maybe if i just erratically just go like crazy at it so i tried doing it like by hand i tried like washing it and they don't come off i mean a lot are coming off it might just be me having to just go crazy Hopefully I'm not alone in this. And, I mean, it still looks pretty crappy. But there is a lot of stuff on the ground here. Why do they, why is it like that? <laughs> probably my dirt and debris and whatever. I probably should buy a new brush, right? <laughs> Don't buy things to clean your brush. When you've had it that long, maybe just buy a new brush. And now, probably because I've showed you this, I will buy a new brush because now I feel I'm going to get some sort of shame from the situation. The only reason they're at the top is because I just pulled all the hair out of it. I mean, a lot's coming out. I'll give it a good college try, as they say, after the, the video and see if I can get more of them off. But I think my mom's is different. I'm gonna call her actually and see if hers is different, and if it is, maybe I'll just borrow hers and keep the brush. I like the brush. I know I can buy it again, but I do like the brush. All right, let me clean up a little bit and do that a little bit more. I can't, I can't stop right now. All right, guys, I gave up. I broke the comb. I gave up. I ordered a new one. It was only $7.50. I don't know. This one used to cost so much money when the Wet Brush Pro first came out. It would think it was like $19.99, but it was only $7.50. So, Wet Brush Pro purchase be here tomorrow <laughs> so no judgment i was feeling 
Kataguri doesn't even like knowing that I showed you that. Hopefully I'm not alone, but that will be going in the trash and I have a new one coming tomorrow. <laughs> By the time this video comes out, I will have it. <laughs> All right, so this one I paid, it was $2 and I paid $1.73. I bought a paper towel holder thing off Wish for work. And number one, it has to slide, because I wanted it to hang, but I didn't want to like really put screws in to my work, because I don't know what that happens when you do that. You know, I rent the room, so I don't know. But when it came, it was like shorter than a normal one, so that it doesn't go the whole way, so if you pull on it, it just gets, becomes a hot mess. So I decided that I was gonna see if this one, if I ordered it, was longer and fit. So this one doesn't either. In Asia, are there paper towels shorter? than hours because when you like go crazy it'll like come off like if you try to like i wouldn't do that but if my client goes to like grab something they'll be like and then the thing goes flying off so that was just a, a little dramatic it doesn't get that bad but yeah so that was a, another fail for me i'll figure that later <laughs> it's never that dramatic but you know you, you get the gist of it but it came with the thing to stick and you just hook it on this like this like this, like this, I don't know, <laughs> like something, like somehow you stick that thing in there, it doesn't really matter because I'm not gonna be able to use it because it also is shorter. Have you ever felt that when you bought something like that? Maybe they have shorter paper towels than we do, I don't know. All right, then we got a few more non-clothing items. I think we have two clothing items today. I'm kind of like shied away from buying clothing because I'd rather just buy clothing like locally at the thrift store or something. And I've always wanted one of these. It was $1.75 and I got it for $1.51. And also to get, to get points, make sure to check in daily, even if you're not gonna be shopping. This is one of those like hot or cold water bottles. I don't know. It has a thing right here. You put it in, you get you to microwave it, and you screw the top on. I'm not testing it out, but I always wanted one and now I have one, so that is all that matters. I wonder if I could just put it, some water in it and just keep it in the fridge. You can just pop it in your head, do whatever you want with it. I don't know. So we got a, we got a few little like failure whatevers, but it is what it is. Then I got these, which I got a long time ago on Wish, but I didn't use like it said, which follow all instructions. So this was $3.75 and I got it for $3.22. So the one I got off Wish did not come with the tape things on it. So it was your job to put the tape things on each one, then peel off these little tapies and stick it on. I was like, it'll totally be fine. Just with two, right? Totally fine. I mean, how much do you really need? No, <laughs> no. So they all fell off and I've been just like just sticking them on. And then the next time you touch it, they fall off like the second bedroom, the, I guess the frame for the bed has sharp corners sharp corners and my vanity sharp corner I constantly get all the time on both sides of my legs just by like moving and turning the side so I won't need all of these but just in case they falter I got backups that are already like set and good to go it is not the funnest thing in the world to try to get these little pieces unless they did something better oh look it's so much easier look the ones I got from wish they were ridic it was so rough I gave, that's why I only did the two. But these are all set and ready to go. Perfecto. I'm not gonna show it to you because you know it is what it is. I'll go over there, I'll stick them on. We'll call it a day. But that will work a lot better. So if it has instructions to use four stickies, use four stickies. Just saying. I totally forgot like half the stuff I got here, so. This right here was $4.75 and I got it for $4.07. What is it? I don't know. Ooh, this is the thing I think that you goes on the side of your car. Like, so you can put your like bones and stuff in. I believe. I can't remember now. I'm gonna have to go look at the picture. Hold on. All right, so here it is. So you can kind of keep things that you want like handy. My seat is really far back right now. And a little zipper place. One part goes over on your thing right there. And the other one I just put 
around because I didn't really say I just put it around my thing right there but that'll be neat to have things a little bit more handy in the car if you need them all right moving on all right so that was like pretty neat I also clipped this on I got it taken care of I figured it out <laughs> I guess if you had a short roll of something you could use this I also wrapped up the <laughs> paper towels it was driving me nuts all right so we have two more items looks like clothing and I have no clue what they are I can't remember months ago months ago so let's open them both up and then we'll try them on i'm wearing a dress pull this works out this is regularly 15 dollars 50 and i got it for 4.93 this must have been on the lightning deals or the flash deals so this says don't look back which is a good saying it's true i mean yeah like you're, they always say, like, don't look behind you. You need to look forward. But this one's a little more creepy. What size is this one? This I got in a size medium. It's a very lightweight, but it is cotton, which is nice. I don't wear much winter stuff, so I don't know why. I mean, except for the winter. I don't know why I bought all this winter stuff. Probably it was on the flash deal, and I was like, I want it. What did I write on this? This is a size medium. It was regularly $20. And I got it for $5.73. I probably just bought it because of the deal. And this is a zip up. It has that, like, their sweatshirt type of material is a little bit different than our sweatshirt material. I feel like it has a little bit more something into it to make it feel, feel a little less real. It does have the fleece on the inside. But I like the fact that I got a zip up for that cheap. And it just has a heart on it. That's it. Nothing crazy. So let's go try these two on. And then we will finish the video it might look weird because i'm going to be like in a dress but it is what it is all right guys so here's this one right here i guess i'm wearing a dress <laughs> so it might look a little strange i like it very lightweight this one i can definitely see wearing in the winter fall-esque um and the next one will kind of be more winter winter but i like zip ups and i don't really have a zip up that's thicker so i'm hoping that's going to work out better sorry the ladies whatever but i'm all over the place downstairs today <laughs> All over the place. All right, let's move on to the zip up. All right, so here we go. I was actually surprised that this was a medium. And then I remembered I bought it in the men's section. So this is a men's medium, not a women's medium. I should probably should have bought a small. I thought, me I thought a medium would be not bad. So yeah, I mean, here's the little logo type thing. It's very warm. Open it up. Got this action. That action, got a hood, I just lift my dress up. <laughs> all right, let's get this off and finish the video. Well, I'll say all in all, those, most of those clothes items were pretty good quality. Like I said, the their sweatshirt material is a little bit different than our sweatshirt material, but I found the ones that I've washed before, they do a turn on okay. I mean, we had a couple fails this time. Nothing really epically failed. Um, everything is still like, this still is legit a product and pretty still works. And we're never ever ever going to talk about that brush again. Never. <laughs> See, if I was whatever, I would like cut it out, cut that whole like clip out, but I'm not. I'm a real person. Like I have things that are not fantastic. Just so you know. So I don't know how many more runways I'm going to be doing. Like I said, I did order some earrings, like a whole haul for earrings. But like I said, I've been going on Sheen a little, Sheen a lot more. I might just bounce around. See where I find the deals. Maybe I'll do a Combo haul at some point would be a Shein and Romway since they are sister companies. At some point, who knows? So, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you have any comments or any questions, please put them down below. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. If you haven't yet subscribed, Paco. Paco, tell them to subscribe. Out. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have an amazing day. I'll see you soon. Bye.